Just hang out online. It's live. It's live. It's on air. Hi. Radiator, what is this? Hey, everybody, and welcome to our weekly show and tell. This is your half an hour to shine, show off your maker projects, your 3D printing, your LEDs, your Arduinos, your Raspberry Pis, whatever it is that you're building, crafting, making, hacking at home. We'd love to see it. So please join this hangout. We have it every Wednesday at 7.30 p.m. to about 8.50, p.m. And uh, this is just a welcome for everybody. Come multiple times. You'll even get a free sticker. Okay. We're going to start off with um, some Adafruit team members, Noah and Pedro. It's Tony Nicola and then Noah and Pedro. Yeah. Afterwards, we'll call and you'll uh, take three to five minutes to show off your project so that we can get out of here at 7.50, 7.55. Okay. And last up, Charles. Hey, Charles. How's it going? Welcome back to Show and Tell. Nice badge. You are so it's yeah. It's lovely. What you got going on this week? Hello, world. I want to give an update. I forgot to mention last week. I'm actually working collaboration with the Enable Less on the phone home project. So this is his Huzzah and FTI AI friend. And this is kind of what the update is on the hand. So we got wires running to the flight sensors, and it's going to be able to control an, another robotic hand. So I printed this one in TPU, flexible material. Oh, wow. It's the flexi hand, but all in one one print piece. Hmm. And here we have the you know, servos all wired up, but I still have to work on some programming, so I figured this week I'd show mostly electrostatic. That's why I got the badge on. So, one second. Let me hook up. I got the fan to graph generator back here. So this creates electrostatic. Running to the similar. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> what is this like mad science yeah. lab? You actually have all the mad, mad scientist gear too. Yeah. Here, 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 so this will create an electric electrostatic effect, and the positive is attached to the top of my hat here, and the negative the wire runs to the ground. Okay. So I'll ground it by stepping on it there, and we'll create an electrostatic effect to when I turn it on, take attract objects. <laughs> <laughs> I tell people about the show and tell them, like, oh, yeah, like, just someone stopped by and they, you know, were able to move something with electricity. And they're like, no, nah, that can't be possible. Like, this is actually happening right now. This is, like, the best science show ever. This is so cool. Yeah. Four 9-volt batteries. You could create your, you know, yourself as an antenna. Yeah. Pieces of paper. These are just, uh, like, chads, they call them. It's hole-punched paper, and you can kind of attract <laughs> <laughs> That's rad. Okay, so I got my electrostatic badge on, so safe. you're fine. Yeah. And that's that's it. That's my show and tell. Wow. Outstanding. Okay, that was really good. That was great. All right. That was, a, that was a magic show. Okay, well, I mean, name your price. I'll send you another electrostatic badge or a show and tell sticker. Um, thanks so much, Charles. That was impressive. Okay. Yeah, that, is a, that is the correct badge yeah. to wear. It could network. All participants on the show and tell get as seen on the show and tell sticker. We're here every single week at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Thank you so much, Tony, Steven, Scott, Richard, John, Pedro, and Charles. We'll see everyone on Ask an Engineer in a few minutes, and thank you for making this the most delightful 20 minutes or so in our week. That was awesome. Yeah. Thanks, everybody. Wow. You got, yeah, the best project yeah. ever. Woo. Oh, I like yeah. the little hand is waving. Yay. Yeah, and then you got like the goggles. <laughs> All right. You got this like mirror yeah. and like escape room. This is like becoming a magic. This, this is, is like wizards. Of... This is way better than the Discovery Channel. Nothing is the Discovery Channel. I think we got the cover now. Yeah. All right. And then finally, Charles had like a multi, it's a, it was a variety show on the show and tell. He had his enabled robotic hand, yeah. which he's using with a feather and a servo driver to control the. Uh, fingers and also maybe do Wi-Fi for remote control. He also has a Tesla coil. He had one of those, what's the, it's like the static ball. It's not a Faraday ball. What's the name Van, of the? Van de Graaff yeah, generator. Van That's the thing. He has a Van de Graaff generator. So that was cool. And then he had a Tesla coil. And that was also real too. He's lighting up. He held a fluorescent bulb near it and it was uh, wirelessly lighting. I'm sure that must have totally flipped out Tesla the first time he did it. He was like, what is going on? Yeah. That's cool. Wireless energy. Uh, and then 
he has a negative ion generator they had strapped to his belt and he turned himself into like a negative ion emitter and so he um, was controlling a ping pong ball on the table just by yeah. like waving his hand over it the ping pong ball would follow because they're um, slightly ionized yeah. in I guess. like a minute and a half it was kind of all the fun science experiments that you show kids yeah or even adults to get interested in science and uh, but it was in three minutes and, and when I when I tell folks like what show and tell is I I understand that when I'm talking to people who don't um, know about this like maker world and electronics they think I'm insane but this even makes it, it, it I think it makes it better but um, if oh no they have this thing and like there's this thing and this other thing and they're gonna show this thing and and I think they think I'm crazy but if you want to have uh, a really good time and you have especially if you have uh, somewhere a kid and, and they want to see something that's not magic it's science you can say like it looks like magic but it's science and you wave your hand over a ping pong ball and it moves around this is a fun little video to show so it's probably yeah. already up on YouTube but look for the show and tell for um, today yeah. uh, May 25th yeah. and like right towards the end and uh, yeah that was anyways. cool thank you so much